Hi everyone, I'm Laurencio and in this video I'm going to talk about all BB Blocksberg games for the GBA. BB Blocksberg, the Amagosche Hexenkreis is a German game. I don't think it's been translated to any other language. And unless you understand German very well, I don't recommend the game, as during gameplay you need to pay attention to what the characters are talking. You can split the gameplay into two parts. During the 13 levels, half of the time you are dodging obstacles while flying on a broom and the other half you do fetch quests. A spell has caused chaos and now BB wants to fix it. During a level you will find for example stuff or people and you need to open up your spell book to see which spell is the most fitting for the occasion and what ingredients you need for the spell to unstuck the object or the people. Then, after you've spent your time exploring for the object or person, you need to search for the ingredients on the map. In some parts you even have to talk to people that have the ingredients. But before getting the ingredient from them, you need to do some quests for them. And this is the game in a nutshell. If you like to explore in a game, then the game might be for you. But if you aren't that much of a fan of games that force you to explore every corner of a level, then the game might not be for you. Also the controls could have been better. You can move only in 4 directions. If you press 2 buttons at the same time, you won't move di diagonally. You can move only in 4 directions. Oh, and I like that the game also has minigames. You can play them when you encounter a big star like this in a level or from the menu. Bibi und Tina Ferien auf den Martinshof is another German only GBA game. This time the game can be played even by non German speakers, at least by my opinion. I I'm a German speaker, so I can't really judge it. So, by exploration, you can guess what you have to do in the game. But what is the game? It's a life on a farm game. You play as two characters, which you can switch whenever you want, BB and Tina. They do the same thing, you just have two characters. Also, what you do with one character isn't transferable to the other. If you take care for example for Tina's horse, BB's horse won't be taken care of. You need to do the same stuff you did with Tina, again with BB. On the farm you can plant carrots, take care of the dog, take care of the horses, ride the horses in two types of minigames, and here at horse riding is the only real complaint I have with the game. The controls aren't comfortable. You get used to them, but they are never comfortable. They feel stiff. Also, just like the other game, this one too has minigames. If you are into horse games or life on a farm games, this one is very good for you, especially if you know German. But if you don't know German, you will have a hard time, but you can deduce what you have to do by exploring everything in, on the farm. Okay, so this was the video. If you liked it, please hit the like button and subscribe. If you want to financially support me in my pursuit to review as many video games as possible, you can do that on Patreon or on the channel's membership section. You will help me a lot. If you want, you can follow me on Twitch, Instagram or Discord. And if you want to see another video of mine, just wait till I stop talking and there will be thumbnails of other videos I've made. Thanks for watching.